adversity is either going to tear you apart or it's going to pull you stronger together. And hopefully through some of this adversity, we can come out a stronger and better football team and better people for it as well. I would like to become a national power. I, I don't think there's a ceiling in this program. You look at the Big East affiliation and the BC automatic bid in the BCS and trying to compete for a berth in the Orange Bowl and the BCS ties for a national championship, the fertile recruiting grounds here in the state of Florida. I, I just think there's so many positives to this program. When I graduated from Notre Dame, I had the opportunity to take a, a very lucrative job for a young student, a young graduate coming out of college in a management company up in Minneapolis. And I turned it down to go to Florida State and be a graduate assistant and pursue the job that I love. I made $400 a month. Uh, was not a lot of money. It was probably just enough to make it uh, at that time. And I pursued the dream and the, the things that I wanted to do because I think money is not gonna buy you happiness. Morals, values, uh, ethics, those type of things. Those, I think those are important values in who I am today. I think I'm so consumed right now with moving forward, it's hard for me to sit back and look in hindsight. I'm not very good at sitting down and deep thoughts. Um, you know, I look back, what is your philosophy of, you know, those type of things. When you're at your press conference and they introduce you as the second head coach in school history and you go, wow, I mean, it puts it all in perspective. Coach Levitt did a great job of building this program. He was here when this was trailers, when it was a dream, when it was just a vision. And he did a great job of building it to be competitive in Conference USA and with the birth into the Big East and to be competitive into the Big East. And so I, I certainly hate the situation and the circumstances and everything that went on here at the end of last year. I think we're all part of the experiences we've had and the people we've met and the people we've worked with. And so uh, I would like to say what's important to Skip Holtz, uh, my family, my wife, my three children uh, are very important to me. I am very competitive from a mindset of wanting to be successful and I'm probably much more motivated by the fear of failure uh, than I am the, the thrills of success. I'm a very uh, humble person. It's not. This isn't about me. I understand there's a much bigger picture.